We're here with Ed Bozalski after tonight's 49 to 20 win over Strasburg. Ed, you were all over the field on defense. Can you just talk a little bit about the game tonight? Well, at first, I think we started off kind of iffy, but after the first couple of plays, we all came together as a team and executed, and that's what really matters. So, uh, would you guys talk about a practice this week to get over the the loss last week? Because you sure came out strong. We pretty much took the game from last week, crumbled it up, threw it in the garbage, forgot about it, and we just got to really come out and play for this week. And that's exactly what it did, and it's great because we played off adversity really well. So I'm really proud of our team and our coaching staff. And uh, can you just talk a little bit about your interception? I know you picked one off. Uh, I just got back in coverage, made sure uh, I was looking for a man not to cover grass, and he threw it my way, and I caught it, ran a couple yards. We're on offense. And uh, you got a long road trip down to Madison. How you feeling about that one? Uh, bringing a pillow. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a long trip. It's definitely a long one. But uh, I think we're gonna do fine. All right. Well, you heard that from Ed Bozowski. He made some big plays on defense tonight in the Eagles' big win. It's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. Thank you. Thanks. You did great. We're here with Peyton Rutherford. Peyton, big night tonight. Five touchdowns. Uh, a lot of yardage. I'm not sure. I think they said you had over 200 in the first half. Just talk a little bit about the comeback game. Uh, yes, sir. We had a, we had a tough week last week. Uh, lost homecoming game. We were pretty upset about it, but coaches told us turn the page and be, get ready for Strasburg, and we we came out and showed we were ready. Uh, was anything said at halftime? Cause it looked like you came out in the second half like you was on a mission or something. <laughs> uh, yes, sir. Uh, coaches got us really excited. I mean, that we were kind of, they were battling with us. Uh, first half and we came out second half we were all just pumped the whole team you could feel it and uh can you just talk a little bit you guys got quite a few injuries but some guys stepped in and did the job it looked like uh yes sir we had some people come in some key spots on defense you know Rico Nappy and uh Ben Sprouse were hurt and uh they came in filled positions and we did really good played good defense and how you feel about the long ride to Madison next week uh Ed says he's taking a pillow. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, I think we're going to be ready. Coaches prepare us very well, and I think we're going to come out strong. All right, well, you heard that from Peyton Rutherford after his big game tonight, five scores and uh, several hundred yards in the Eagles' big win. It's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. Thanks a lot, Peyton. We're here with Eagles head coach Chris Parker. Uh, coach, a little bit happier situation than last week. Yeah, yeah much happier. Uh, I like this a lot better than last week. Uh, Really proud of our guys. I mean, we responded well, I thought. Uh, had adversity, had some kids that were banged up, as everybody knows, and, you know, injury and new uh, people playing in new positions. And I thought that we were uh, focused, ready to play, and I was really impressed how we came out the second half. Uh, our guys didn't let up, and we stayed focused. Yeah, and uh, Strasburg's quarterback's a real good passer. I know you uh, made some adjustments. And, of course, he got hurt late in the third quarter, but you really shut that pass game down. They were sacking him a few times. Yeah, our uh, pressure on him improved throughout the game, I thought. And then our secondary played pretty well. Uh, I think as the game went on, we got better. We were a little shaky there at the beginning. But uh, when you have nice pressure like that in the secondary, uh, gets a little bit better like we like we did, I mean, good things are going to happen. And uh, obviously, you must have had a pretty good week in practice this week, I'm assuming? Yes, we did. Uh, we stayed positive. We corrected the mistakes from the game. Uh, and I thought we were well prepared. Uh, we knew exactly what they were going to do. And, uh, you know, our guys responded. The biggest question mark for us was how the, uh, the kids that were playing in different or new right. positions we're going to respond, and they did pretty good. And uh, Colby probably had his biggest night rushing. Was that – did they just give you something that you saw, or was that in part of the game plan because he ran several times at night? Uh, well, it was something that they gave us. I mean, you know, in our type of offense, the ball gets around a lot of different hands. And, uh, you know, we try to distribute it. And I know Peyton had a lot of touches, but, uh, you know, Kyle and Colby – any play can touch the ball also, depending on what we run. Right. Well, you got uh, Ed says he's taking a pillow next week. Got a long ride. What do you think about Madison? 
Uh, Madison, you know, I mean, again, it's tough playing down there. It's a long trip, like you said. Uh, you know, Coach uh, Rhodes played for me, played for us, right. you know, and I'm sure he's going to have them fired up. They're going to, I guess his team is going to you know, try to, you know, get one for him because he knows he graduated from Clark. Right. Or, but, uh, you know, I, I'm sure our, our guys are not going to take it lightly and they're going to respond. Okay, well, you heard that from the head coach, Chris Parker, after the 49-20 to 20 victory over Strasburg. Uh, the Eagles moved to 7-1. and one. Yes, sir. And uh, we'll head to Madison next week. It's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. Thanks, man. Thanks a lot. Coach. Appreciate it. Yeah, I might have to interview.